Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another video. Today we're going to be playing some of the TTS with the new season, Operation Brutal Swarm. We're going to be trying out the new Operator Grim, and most importantly to me, we're going to be trying out the new Recoil, and I'm going to be giving you guys my first-hand experience with everything that comes with the new Operation. And just a little side note, I have not played the new season whatsoever. Normally I play early, and Ubisoft did invite me to play early, but uh, I didn't have the time to play early this season, so this is going to be my first experience with the whole operation. So if you guys like this video, feel free to like the video, subscribe if you're new, turn those notifications on as I do post daily here on the channel, so you're not going to want to miss any of the future videos that I have coming out. But it looks like we've got a game, so let's hop straight into it. Why are you still playing that laptop, bro? I can't afford a new PC. Have you checked out Apex Gaming PCs? No, I haven't. What's that? They're these like really affordable computers that you could pick up. They're really good for like console players who are trying to get into PC gaming or for like people who like yourself who have a laptop or something and want to upgrade for like an affordable price. Let me check it out. Yeah, you can use my link. You could also use code shock to get up to $250 off if you're interested. Ah, uh, so here's the new band system. So now if you guys don't know how it works, basically they're going to be showing you guys five different maps from the map pool and both teams can only ban one map. So you see right there, both of us banned a different map and it cycles between the three remaining maps. Now, if both teams were to ban the same map, it would cycle between the other four maps. So I don't know how I feel about this just yet. I haven't gotten enough time to actually play with it, but uh, you guys will have to let me know what you guys think about it in the comments. Maybe it's a good thing. Maybe, you know, ranked will feel a little bit more fresh now as we're gonna be playing a bunch of different maps. Also, another cool thing is you can see down here, this is new, objective can be found in one of these locations. So they're trying to help new players by basically showing where, um, you know, the defenders could possibly go to. Now, the new operator has the SGCQB as well as the 552 Commando. We won't go too much in depth because I'm gonna assume that you guys have already seen the reveal. This isn't really a video trying to showcase all the new things of the new season but kind of just giving my opinion on it and the one thing i will say right now automatically is my first round first game of the new season i am hyped to play grim for two reasons number one he's a three speed which is great we haven't had a new three speed operator in forever number two he's a three speed operator with the sgcqb and you guys already know i am an sgcqb connoisseur and I am absolutely hyped to get in and play with this weapon on a three-speed operator. I think it's going to be a ton of fun. Oh, uh, they left the construction wall soft here. I might try to push in here. I'm a little bit worried, though, about someone being in construction. I'm going to try to drone through the drone hole here. I can't help you there. The plan is to drone in through here, make sure everything's yeah, clear, the and then we'll do a little bit of a rush key. Yeah, so see, there's one in garage right now. I just want to be careful about how we address this. Right, we got to go quick here. It's really far back. I don't know if we're going to be able to. He's on a C4. All right. See if we can get some pings on him with the new new gadget. Oh, we do. We got the pings. High trailing top. All right, all right, all right. Here's what we're going to do, guys. Here, I got a, I got a shot. We're going to shoot this in. We're going to go underneath, and we're going to shoot his feet through the floor. Frost over here on stairs. Reload. Where are my pinks? Oh, yes, ladies and gentlemen. The new operator's gadget already showing how effective it is. Now, that is going to be sick. The SGCQB combined with this gadget doing plays like that is going to be awesome. I've got another idea. I don't know if it's gonna work. I think my, my teammates are already in, so it's not gonna work. I'm gonna push up here. Oh, I put it on the wall. That was a bad idea. Oh, yes. Oh, yes, ladies and gentlemen. That is how it's done. The first round ever. And I've played Grim on the new season. We hit a little 4K. I wish we had the ace, but it's all good. We can't be too greedy, right? I'm trying to reason with Chrome 233 here about giving me the new operator. I'm trying to let him know. I'm trying to record a video with the new operator here. But he doesn't seem to be interested in giving me the operator. But I really wanted to pull off some more strats. You guys know I love going below with uh, 
various different operators and trying to use shotguns and all that. So this operator is so perfect for my play style. Unfortunately, Chrome is going to take the new op this round, which is all good, though, because we want to test the new recoil, right? There's still things for us to test, and I'm I'm not going to shoot my gun really at all. I'm going to kind of play naturally and, uh, you know, just kind of have it surprise me, I guess. I've heard that the recoil is really bad. I've heard that it's mixed. I've heard that there's a lot of recoil. Um, I've heard that it's no recoil. I have no idea what to expect, and I haven't watched any gameplay, so I'm really going in blind here. And this first gunfight could really mess me up. We'll see what's going to happen. First contender might be this Goyo. Oh, it's definitely some more vertical recoil. Oh, he got me. I leaned the wrong way there. It's all good. All good. Check out this new uh, spectate thing in the bottom left. I actually like this. So beforehand, I believe it was just dots in the bottom left or if anything at all but now you can actually see exactly who you're gonna go spectate i think that's really cool so the strat that i had in mind for grim this round is i was gonna go underneath on green box you can shoot underneath the box itself and there's enough space to actually shoot the gadget up it'll hit the bottom of green box the bees will expand into the room detect anyone in there and i could actually start shotgunning them through the floor but Maybe next round. We'll see what happens. Ah, uh, Chrome getting taken out. So it looks like there might not be a next round for this site. Not for a while, at least. As it looks like we're going to end up losing this round. Yeah, unfortunate. All good, though. All good. Chrome with a 200 ping. That is rough. Look how long he stayed outside. Didn't tell me about Wow, that's the Goyo with the 1.5, by the way. I just noticed that. Lots of new changes. Lots of new changes. I snagged Grim from Chrome, so we're, we're eating up this round. Although, I believe they're going to go downstairs, so I'm not really sure how I'm going to use the SGCQB. There's not much I can really do with it, I feel like. I feel like the best case scenario is maybe trying to shoot people through the floor on the back of uh, Arsenal. But I'm probably going to actually go for the Commando, which is lacking any sort of higher magnification zoom scopes which is interesting because i'm pretty sure in iq you have at least a 1.5 if on an acog on the 552 commando oh i've got black ice for this on the tts yo we are eating up let's go guys look at this i have uh red crow skins on here i'm, I'm correct me if i'm wrong i'm pretty sure it's a red crow skin i don't even know if i have this skin on my main account well, this is my main account but like on the live build i mean I might be wrong. Maybe that's like a new skin. I have no idea. I think that's from Red Crow, though. Ten seconds before insertion. Maybe not. We're going to try to go into kitchen and we're going to play. Five oh, never mind. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. No, I couldn't change the shotgun. I wasn't paying enough attention. I thought they would go downstairs because that's what most people would do. But they went back to gym. Which doesn't make much sense to me personally. But whatever. We'll we'll make it work with the, the commander. This gun's nasty. Oh, the recoil, though. I've got to play more with it to really form an opinion, but... Oh, fuck. Weird. Sorry, dude. Really weird so far. Not bad. How is this guy alive? There we go. Oh, my God. This guy did not want to die, bro. It was mostly my fault. I was just missing my shots, but... <laughs> that no, no 1.5 is really rough trying to take gunfights like that. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to try to do a little bit of a drone ski here. We're going to we're going to do a long strat. We're going to open this window a little bit so that we can drone through it. Reload. We're going to come back to this hatch. All right. We're going to drone in through this window. And we're going to see what there is to see. So, so far, hash is clear. But construction is not. We're just going to go for it, guys. That's Ella. You're exposed. Stairs, hold on. One's on stairs, he said. Where's there? Where's there? Uh, the timing, I looked away and I got downed right then. I thought we had Breach open. We do, so I'm not... Sh yeah, we have Sledge on Breach and this guy is in the hallway swinging me. That's unfortunate. That probably shouldn't happen. <laughs> there we go. He finally got the kill. Oh, you just saw him climb up. There we go. Oh my gosh. I'm inside. The things you see in the TTS server, right, guys? I think it's construction. Yep. Oh, he actually got smoked. 
He got smoked. Wait, you had more ammo in your R4C than you do the pistol. Why did you switch? <laughs> oh, wow. The TTS is wild, bro. Behind. Oh, no. Engine. Behind the weights. Yep. Unfortunate. This high water guy on the other team is nasty, bro. It's it's literally me versus him. It's me versus him in the Goyo, to be honest. It's all good though, because do you know what High Water and Ren Renvio, however you say his name, you know what they don't have, ladies and gentlemen? They don't have a cup of blue ice G fuel by using code shock to get 30% off with a link in the description. They just don't have it. But guess what I have? I have a new shaker cup full of G fuel here, blue ice. It's great. So I think we take some sips of that and uh, we turn up here. Wow, I have gold dust on this weapon on the TTS. You know what's crazy, ladies and gentlemen? I have gold dust, but I don't have it for the MP5 on the live build. I have it for the L85. The um, so the fact that I have gold dust on the MP5 on the test server, oh, it's hurting my soul. It's hurting my soul, guys. Wow, look at the TV. That's different. All right, so I think what we're going to do here is we're going to try to do my super OP spawn peak. Although we need to shoot this drone or it's not going to work. I think I hear two drones in here. This guy's juking me out. All right. Try this bomb peak. First bomb peak on the new season. Are we lit? Doka be up. Come on, Doka be. I think she already crossed. I hate these little things right there. They throw me off. Where is that? Oh, I, I figured it out. It was stock. I, you know, I was like, I think that's stock, but I couldn't tell. Uh, that's just on me. I should have paid attention to the audio more. Wow, he is trying to contest Garage Raptors with Ella Scorpion on the new recoil, which is supposedly a lot more difficult to control. So I want to see how this is going to go. Especially he's against, well, I guess he's against the M762. So maybe it won't be that bad. It's like a high recoil versus high recoil gunfight right now. Oh, but Renvio is going to clutch it out. Oh my goodness. Chrome from the top rope. Oh no. Watch your red stairs. Well, my, he's on the red stairs. Wow. We're getting smoked, guys. All right, all right, all right. We, we got to pull this back. We got to pull this back. There's no way we can lose our first game on the new season. We got to pull things back. We got to go downstairs. We got to stay in sight and we got to clutch this out here. Let's figure out what we need to do. I think I just play dock and sit on site. I don't think we need to do anything special. I think I tried to get a little too cocky last round, but we'll just stay on site. We'll hold our angles and we'll pray for the best. All right, I'm going to run up and get some of the hatches because I don't have much uh, utility. I have pretty much nothing, just two barb. I'm going to try to get some hatches. Although, Cade should be also getting hatches here, if we're being honest. But normally, like, this, I see this... I see this not happen in rank two too often. If you don't have any utility, especially on a map like Clubhouse, just run up and get the hatches. Because someone like Jaeger has a lot to set up comparably to me. So you want to try to help out the team and get the hatches there. Throw some barbed wire on the main stairs. Wow, we don't have anything reinforced or set up down here. We have no holes. The triple wall is not reinforced. I'm worried if dirt's even reinforced. I honestly don't even know if I want to go see. Oh, okay, we did get dirt. Thank the Lord. And Vio already killing out Chrome. Not looking good here. There's no rotates into blue. Gabo's AFK. All right, our teammate just disconnected. Okay, up. Oh, that's a Capcom trap. Oh no, I missed the shots on zero. Oh, that twitch was sneaky though. Crouched all the way up there. Okay, my teammates got this, I believe. 2v4, easy. Especially if they all rush blue like this. 
All right, never mind. Thing. Tide water with a wall bang. Yeah, it's gonna be GG's. Hey, at least Zof made a rotate for us, right? Oh, yikes. Yikes. Well, that's the first game down. We'll play a few more. I didn't get to gauge the new season enough just off that. I think the new title screen is pretty cool. I don't know what you guys think. I guess that's what the bees look like up close. Looks like a, a little microchip on like a, a tiny drone. <laughs> it's interesting. Yeah, like first impressions of the operator uh, based off my first game so far. Honestly, pretty fun. A lot better than Sense. I remember when Sense came out last season and I I don't even know if I played the TTS. I genuinely don't think I did. I waited until the season was fully released and I remember playing Sense for the first time and I was like, wow, this operator sucks. <laughs> like if I wanted to do what Sense can do, I would just, I would go like Twitch with smokes or something like that. You know what I mean? Like I'd go an operator with smokes. Sense was just like so meh and especially his weapons were so bad. But the thing about Grim is I actually like his weapons. You guys already know the SGCQB, one of my favorite weapons in the entire game. And I feel like he has a lot of potential with what you can do with him. Going underneath, shotgunning a hole in the floor, throwing up the bees through the floor, and then shotgunning people as they get pinged. Like I did that Goyo the first round. I think stuff like that is going to be really, really cool. And I think there's some creative stuff you could be had with Grim. As I say that though, we got our first game. Oh, and there's a new load-in screen. That's pretty cool. I liked that. I didn't get to see it very, uh, very long, but that that looked pretty cool. We're against uh, Renvio again. This guy was the goat last game. Oh, in Stadio, Stadium Bravo, the new map. So if you guys are newer to Siege, Stadium Bravo. I'm not sure if that's what it was called at the time. I think it was just called Stadium. But basically, Stadium was a map that they added into the game uh, back in 2021. And it was a mix between coastline and border. And it was a lot of fun. And I hate to see that they just banned it. Instead of bank, you guys know I hate bank. This map is some dog ass. Yeah, Swag Lord set up perfectly. Bro, how am I supposed to play the new map? I really- uh, the other game mode. It's just that map, I think. Yeah, we might have to go play that to, to get a feel for the new map. But I, I really do hate how people just ban everything that's new. That's actually why in the ban phase here, you'll see that for the attackers, you actually can't ban Grim, the new operator. Because back in the day in the TTS, you could actually ban the new operator. And it was a nightmare. Every single game, people would troll and ban the new op. And no one would get to play it. So, like, the whole point of the TTS was completely defeated. But uh, luckily, they changed that. I wish it was the case with the new map as all right, I guess we're going to go downstairs to lockers first. I want to play Goyo. Let's play Goyo with the new 1.5. This is going to be interesting. I'm not sure how I feel about it just yet. It, it To me, it sounds like we could have another alibi situation on our hands. But we'll, we'll play around with it and, and see how the recoil is. Because the recoil on some of the guns is definitely a little bit rough. Um, I wouldn't say it's like necessarily hard to control. You can definitely feel the difference. There's a lot more vertical Protect recoil, the uh, especially the longer you shoot now. So I'm not sure how I feel about it just yet. I, I gen generally, I don't like core mechanics like that getting changed. And looking back, like most of the time when they've changed something like a recoil, it's it's been pretty bad. So, and I'm not sure. You guys have to let me know down in the comments. Were you guys around when they made the recoil? Um, pretty much the exact same thing as CSGO. They act, there was a point in time where the recoil was exactly like CSGO. It never made it past the test server, but I promise you it was a thing. All right, let's go to test for the recoil. Oh my God, there's a lot of recoil, guys. Thank God I shot the gun first. There is a lot of recoil. Oh, I don't have a C4. Guy's actually walking in on me. Oh, there's a guy head glitching back there. I wanted to kill. I don't have the C4 on Goyo, which is weird. Would have been able to kill that Zof if I had it. I hear a Montane above me. I think they're already on the stairs here. Be advised, a bomb. That's A stud. Is this a Blitz or a Montane? All right, Montane. I'll work with that. Wish I had a C4, but no way. What are you doing? You want an open? 
I've got the bomb. Oh no, he honest swung me close. I didn't hear him close. I wouldn't I wouldn't have been so cocky if I knew he was close like that. That's all good. Goyo 1.5 is interesting. It doesn't feel that bad, but definitely if you're trying to like shoot that gun for a long time at range, I, I don't know how we're gonna be able to control it. Oh, this guy's sneaking in through garage here. Oh, he's sneaking all the way in. Valk, you gotta get off cam and do something about this, bro. You already know where he's at. Quit Z picking, get off cams. No, he's killing your whole team. Get off cams. There we go. Oh my gosh. Hey, let's go. All right, so we're gonna go top floor now. I might just mess around with the Goyo a little bit more. I'm not sure if there were any more changes to operators, such as gaining scopes or losing scopes, um, or just like any other fundamental changes like that. I didn't look at the actual patch notes. I just watched the reveal and they didn't delve deep into things such as like Goyo getting a 1.5. I don't even know if it was mentioned. I just saw it on Twitter. So you guys will have to let me know down in the comments if there's any other changes you'd like to see me check out but so far on defense we're gonna try to stick with the uh goyo 1.5 i think oh i've got the proximity alarms on goyo again that is tragic i just forgot to change back to a c4 unless he got it taken away but i never heard anything about that i hear a fink lmg apparently it's really bad though so i'm actually not that worried about it i've seen a video on twitter and it looked pretty bad so for once I hear the Finca LMG and I'm not concerned for my safety as much. <laughs> oh, this is scary. Still an LMG. Oh no, dude, this this guy always kills me when I'm not looking at him. It's really unfortunate. Oh, there's just so many people in here too. Wow. Alright. There's just three people in staff. I had no idea. I guess I was uh I don't know. That was, that was a drop maybe I shouldn't have taken. Bro, Alibi is getting hunted down right now. This is rough. He literally has the whole other team hunting her down. Let's see a Tanner. Oh, Tanner, 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 Tanner. What the hell? What happened? Bro, Tanner threw a C4. He literally had at least one kill, maybe two on his hands. If he just hit the, if he hit the button and he just stood still, what happened? He didn't lag out. He only has 40 ping. Poor guy just like... I don't know. He lagged out IRL or something. That was crazy. I will say though that like just moving around and looking around, the TTS does feel pretty smooth. So I'm not sure what that's about, but I've been playing the main build recently and it doesn't feel this smooth. So. I don't know. Maybe it's just me. Maybe today I just... Feel a little bit better at the game, but it does feel nicer. All oh, the timing. Oh no, this could be bad. A bomb has been located by op four. That's the process, One guys. The operator remaining. One on my right. No, I think I downed Amaru. Wow, the Finca just didn't push. Oh, she's reloading. That's what it was. I was like, damn, this Finca's never going to push. All right, we're playing the new operator now. I definitely think the 552 is going to be the best option here for bank. I don't know if the SG is going to be really even playable on bank, but I guess it might actually be good for pushing like the staircases. Um, my only worry is I don't have like an SS, uh, SMG to kind of contest later in the rounds. But the shotgun would be nice if they didn't like a blue hold for example and they're holding the staircase you could potentially like throw your gadget in there get some pings on them and then like push in um yeah i don't know you know what this gadget reminds me of and it's probably just because i've been playing a lot of apex recently grim's gadget reminds me of the seer ultimate from apex i don't know let me know what you guys think in the comments does the new gadget on Grim remind you of Sears Ultimate from Apex Legends. To me, it does. If you think about it, like, obviously they're different, really so but grenades. I'm pretty sure Sears uh, gadget is literally micro drones. Um, so when you think about it, so is Grim's gadget. So both gadgets are micro drones and Sears Ultimate basically puts out this like, seconds. you know, circle or this dome. Or if you're in it, you get pinged, you get live pinged. And Grim's gadget does the same thing, really. 
So I, I find that interesting. Maybe Ubisoft got some inspiration from Apex. Who knows? <laughs> this is like top five worst angles. I hate peeking open area like this. It's so sketchy. All right, looks like we've got things. I'm gonna push in. He's sticking this. How did he stick that? What? <laughs> hey, I finally got a gunfight against that guy. <laughs> Can't tell what I'm hearing. Strand. I, I swear there's one above us. Maybe I'm tripping, guys. Maybe I'm tripping. And the gate. Oh no, that's not what I wanted. What? Oh, I hit him with it. I hit him with the gadget. I'm on a soft wall. One up, four remains. Nice. Pincers. Let's go. Four wow, the, the recoil doesn't feel bad at all on this gun. I actually really like it. You know, if, I mean, it feels pretty natural. I was trolling a little bit with the gadget guys. Let's not lie. I think what happened is I was th I, when I first shot that the gadget, the first shot that missed and hit the wall, I was thinking to myself, this might clip and hit the wall. And it, of course it did. And then the second shot, I was like, this should go into the, into the hallway there, but I think it might hit my gadget on the wall. And it did. And it hit, hit my first gadget that I missed and bounced off into the corridor we were in like that was just unfortunate i just wasted like half my utility in a room that we had already cleared yeah you guys will have to let me know down in the comments if you enjoy these longer sort of videos with more commentary so far like the feedback has been pretty good a lot of you guys have been saying you really like the longer videos with commentary so uh i've never really directly asked though so if you guys do just let me know down in the comments but uh if you are show me by liking the video commenting of course does help but liking the video definitely shows me that you guys are enjoying and if you guys subscribe it also is a pretty good indicator that you're enjoying the content. Consider turning notifications on if you haven't. It mean a lot to me. Once again, I do post daily here on the channel. So if you uh, are enjoying this type of video, then I do post them practically every single day. So if you don't want to miss another video, make sure to subscribe. All right, let's get some drone skis in here. What are we looking at? Legion mine on the window. That's pretty typical. Open area looks to be clear so far. You always got to drone behind these desks, guys. People don't drone behind the desks. And that's how that's how catastrophes happen, okay? Always drone behind the desks. You seem to be good. I didn't drone staff, though. Oh, that's scary. I'm trying to hide my laser on this wall here. Oh, I think he killed him upstairs. Nice. I uh, can't quite reach it. All right, we've got a lot of us on the staircase here. I'm not sure if that's the right strategy. We've got a chunk of firing off the stairs as well. I'm going to go try to... Ooh, actually, there's a guy top square still. Activating him. Oh, he already walked down the stairs. Ah, oh, that's unfortunate. I think my timing was bad there. Ah, oh, my timing was... Oh, no. The timing was just bad there. That's unfortunate. Down to one friendly. Uh, it looks like we're gonna lose this round. That's all good. Still got time to bring it to OT. This knock actually looks pretty decent. Uh, nice shot. Uh, but yeah, like I was mentioning before, I'm trying to uh, kind of implement these longer videos because you guys really seem to enjoy them. Um, but you guys have to let me know any feedback. Like if you, I'm not really sure how I'm gonna end up editing this video down. But uh, if you guys like want to see, you know, more of these games shown, if you want to see less of the games shown, um, you know editing styles if you if you guys like to see something different just feel free to let me know down in the comments i'm always up for some constructive criticism but with that being said let's play my man sledge because you know what we haven't played the l85 with the new recoil oh my goodness there's my gold dust skin i actually have this on the main build so i'm not i'm not too worried about this but it is a really nice skin all right and let's take a look at the new uh barrel descriptions as if you guys 
didn't know along with the recoil changes they also updated what each barrel does so the flash header here reduces oh, speed at yeah. which the muzzle moves upwards so this is going to be for your vertical recoil horizontal movement while shooting that's going to be your compensator your muzzle break is the overall weapon kick of a single shot so that's great for like dmrs and the suppressor removes the muscle flash bullet trails are less visible and the muffled sound reduces noise and a neat thing that they did with the suppressors this season is they also removed the kind of debuff i guess you would call it where suppressors do less damage um so that's no longer a thing which i think is pretty cool now unfortunately i was doing too much talking and i didn't forget or i forgot to uh change to a 1.5 and we might get taken out before i even get the shoot a bullet what am i getting shot by i see tracers but no ella it's really weird I just heard an ADS get placed here. Oh, and there's barbed wire. Jaeger is definitely holding this one down. Yep. Cover me. All right, let's try to see what we can do. Randy ran. I can't nade him though, because he's got two ADSs here. Oh, I see someone through the drone hole too. Man, I see someone through the drone hole. This would be nice. That's a nade. Oh no, teammate. I tried getting the barbed wire. Ah! Yikes. Alright, hold on. Let's try to get this guy through the drone hole. Can't really see. See the Thunderbird, but I don't see the operator anymore. Throw another drone. See what we're working with here. Oh, she's right there. How can I not see her? There we go. I was like, I could have swore I saw Thunderbird speed in there. Uh, electrified barbed wire, all right. I haven't seen that since year one. Door is barricaded. I'm, yeah, I'm, okay. I'm trying to get an angle on this, but Pup was all up in there. It's all good, he's got it. I actually really like the uh, reflex uh, C on this gun. All right, I think we hop back onto the Goyo. I do want to try some operators like smoke though. I want to, I kind of want to see how the recoil is. You know, let's actually do that. Let's, uh, let's play smoke a little bit here. I want to see how the recoil is going to be on, uh, higher recoiled guns. Oh, uh, I've got a, I've got barbed wire on smoke. I swear all of my TTS, like secondary gadgets are all messed up. I've got proximity alarm on Goyo, barb on smoke. It's all a mess. Oh yeah, me and Chonka are doing some reconstruction. Good lord, we are doing some reconstruction. Wait, it's 3-3 three, three, match point? Do these, is match point at 3-3 three, three in the uh, TTS? I didn't know that. That is odd. Oh, this has no recoil still. Okay. The SMG 11 has no recoil. Roaming smoke. Dude. Yo, sign that guy up for Pro League. Someone give this guy a professional contract. That guy is a professional droner if I've ever seen one. Oh my god. New icon for the bomb too. Uh, it's interesting. What are we doing here, guys? We got like a party going on. I'm gonna play the stairs here with the shotgun. I got the hatches open. This is not good. I need someone to push the stairs so I can get a, an opener. I need some frags. Uh oh, new gadget. Are they dropping? I don't think so. Oh, a zombie's in a bad spot, bro. Trust the process, ladies and gentlemen. Trust the process here. Trust what I'm doing. Trust the process, ladies and gentlemen. Never mind. Never mind. <laughs> Chris Lee Jr. is sitting right here. Damn, he was reloading too. That was gonna be the freest kill of my life. I just I didn't think to check that. Oh no, that might be the, the death of us here. Yeah. Damn. It's crazy how little things like that can cost the whole game. I just should have checked that corner. Hard breaking defeat, so I guess the TTS matches uh only go to uh, four rounds um i just joined a game midway through somehow 
Midway and mid round through. That is interesting. I don't know what happened. Wow, that audio. The audio wasn't bad there. A lot of people would say the audio was bad. So right where the Yana was shooting was where he was diffusing, right? But the audio came from the right side because that was the closest uh like hole down. That sounded awful. Right, I'm gonna try to go underneath here. Shotgun. Wait, why is this guy down here? Oh what? A random ass captain. Alright, let's run for this captain. Still down here, bro. What's this guy doing? Put three traps down here? Oh, this is not even the site. <laughs> like, why are there three traps on this door? I am mind boggled. I, I'm gonna shoot them just to shoot them. What in the world? He just killed my teammate all the way over there. <gasps> Saw two people. Library. Coming from trophy. The diffuser is no longer in your possession. The spooky. One high set. Oh no no no. Wow. Still Vigil one trophy. Was, uh, inside library. All right, you got him. You got him. Alrighty. Shock, you're my daddy. Great. Right. I'm gonna drown and try to keep people to the floor here. Alright, there's one here. Come with one of those. Got one deployed. Reload. Right, he moved. Maybe bathroom now. Bathroom hallway. Out of bag. Piano. Um, nothing, huh? All right. Top four last stop standing. Oh, last one. Probably master, right? Oh, he is. Oh, let's go. That was scary. Oh my god. Shotgun is too good, man. Shotgun is really too good. We joined like that was our first round. So we're already doing better than half the team. Over half the team. Well, wow. said so we like tryhards on the TS brand. I don't even want to hear from this guy. Listen, this dude and he. This dude literally is like I think he's five stacking in in the TTS. Is that the real one? Like at the very least, he's three stacking yeah. with his team in TTS. He's talking about me tryharding. Only I've only been here one round. I just walked in with a shotgun. I'm putting myself at a disadvantage with the shotgun. <laughs> like, I don't know, man. Streaming? I've noticed like lower ranking players have this like terrible mindset where if they just like die or someone on the other team is really good, they automatically think they're like really good. Oh, I didn't think sweating. that was him, but then he one tapped them with a pistol. I also love that this guy has a shotgun because I have not played this game in like two days. But like, my aim is pretty bad. So the ability to just like run around with the shotgun and not even have to aim is so nice.